Hello there guys, this is Robot Squad and today's video is actually gonna be interesting as I'm going to show you a few cool command prompt tricks that you can show to your friends to impress them, right? So the first trick is opening command prompt from particular directory. So suppose I want to open command prompt from downloads I will open cmd from downloads, just go to downloads directory and type cmd in the search bar and just click on enter. And now cmd has opened from the directory downloads. So that's the first trick. Uh, a cool trick, a short and sharp trick. Not so impressing, but a useful trick. Okay, so the second trick. The second trick is changing the color, either background or foreground or both. Right, so you can change the background and the foreground color of CMD. If you if you knew it, please comment down below. Okay, so now uh, to run the uh, command, just type color and O2. So this is just an example of a black background and a green foreground. And it's actually a very cool uh, trick. Um, and you guys might be wondering how did I do that? Just click on, uh, just type color help color space help and then you'll have this set of you know the, you'll have this uh, description about the color command and you have set of colors over here with an identity uh, each color has its own identity from numbers to letters so it's uh, you might have got the idea right now right so just type color and the background and the foreground color now you don't have to type black slash blue you just have to type the number of the color so now i want it uh, so now i want blue as a background and yellow as a foreground blue is for one yellow is for six i just have to type one six and there you go right so it's as simple as that now i want to make it normal and so too so yeah that's a cool trick and uh, that was the second trick now the third trick is changing the title of the command prompt okay it is a very simple thing to do uh, you have this windows system 32 i'm gonna make it disappear and uh, give it a more interesting title right so just type title space any title suppose um uh, what about the matrix right so the matrix and now the title changes to the matrix and that is a very cool feature in command prompt and now the fourth trick is changing the prompt name okay that is a very simple trick now you have this user user downloads a directory through which you are running the commands yeah, it looks boring right it looks so boring you want to change it okay so just type prompt and um, any desired name suppose uh, robot squad and uh, just click on enter and there you go so now uh, this user user downloads directory has changed to robot squad although the directory is still the download the name of the prompt has changed so now you can run any command suppose i, I just now i ran the directory command and it worked and it's so cool as it looks as if the robot squad is giving the command right even though the directory downloads is giving the command so it's a cool feature and now the fifth command the fifth command is so 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 so, so interesting right it's Okay, believe me or not, you can watch Star Wars movie. Star Wars movie in command prompt. It's simple, just type telnet towel dot blinking lights dot nl and click on enter. So you get this. You get this thing, and this is where the movie starts. So uh, it's actually a. Uh, you know it's a 2d film as you can see and it is made up of symbols right everything is made up of symbols you can find uh, in your keypad everything is so cool right you find animations and it's like it's so cool i mean who would have ever thought who would have ever thought that you can watch a star wars movie in command prompt right uh, anyways the command for this uh, the command for all these tricks will be kept in the description and in including the timestamps. So, yeah, enjoy the movie.
but uh, unfortunately few people can't see this animation if uh, i mean few people can't run this animation in their uh, command prompt unless uh, they have uh, a telnet uh, you know telnet client feature on on the pc right so many people might have it still uh, you know they uh, they cannot uh, run the pro, uh, the command as you have not initialized it so to initialize it uh, it's a simple thing to do just go to windows features this turn windows features on or off just click on that and then uh, navigate to telnet client right so this thing over here telnet client so this feature should be on for that you have to tick this check box okay so you have to tick the check box so the check box is unchecked and uh, you click on okay it's useless uh, you can't run the telnet i mean you can't run the uh, star wars movie in it so you have to click it and now click on okay it might take some time to initialize the feature so that you can watch the command prompt uh, working on the movie so that's all for now that's all for now guys uh, we'll meet in a new video um, please make sure to like the video share this video comment down below and subscribe to robot squad so till then peace out